amongst all the luminous matter out there, meaning everywhere we can look, we find evidence of magnetic fields. So it's an essential component of the world. So when you're looking at astrophysical plasmas, cosmic plasmas, as they move around, the magnetic fields move with them. If I took a parcel of that, of, of that plasma and moved it, it would drag the magnetic field with it. Now, if I then let it go, it's a bit like being attached by an elastic string to where it was before. And so the magnetic field would try to drag it back. And it turns out that when you stretch and tangle magnetic fields, usually chaotically, the magnetic fields grow. Well, chaos means what it sounds like, right? It's random motion. If you see chaos on multiple scales, you could say, well, this is probably turbulence. It can be uh, not just random motions, but also random fields. In plasma turbulence, uh, plasma turbulence is a combination of random motions and, and random electromagnetic fields. Magnetic turbulence and plasma turbulence are very nonlinear phenomena. These are things that a theoretician with a pencil and paper is not in a, in a position to predict. Computer modeling of, of nonlinear phenomena, specifically of turbulence, is, is something where you can see tangible progress, right? We can do more now than we could yesterday. There is a range of methods to uh, take these equations and code them up and, and, and produce numerical solutions. Pursuit of one's curiosity about the world is one of the hallmarks of civilized society. This pursuit has as its byproducts the kind of scientific understanding of reality and the kind of technology that, count, that, that goes with it that then tremendously improves the material level of life. Because if you know plasma physics, you can help yourself and your fellow human beings understand something not just about astrophysical objects, but you can also understand things like how you can find hot plasma inside a magnetic cage, which is another word for how do you develop, a, how do you build a fusion power plant. That may well be mighty useful for keeping the lights on. All this improvement in our material level of life is a kind of a reward that we have reaped for being a curious species. Nonlinear plasma physics is a really fascinating thing to study.